It's a Halloween nail tutorial, a, a quick tutorial for our seven days of Halloween. I decided to do these gorgeous Halloween witchy nails and I will be showing you guys how I achieved this cute and simple budget friendly look. For my Halloween look, I'll be using Dashing Diva Gloss Gel Palette. These are gel polish that stick on and they last up to 14 days. And I'll also be using some nail extensions that I purchased from my local Sally Beauty. Now I am going in with this handheld electric buffer that I purchased from Target that was only like $9 and it is a super fast and super easy to use. I am first going in with the cuticle pusher and that's just to clean up my cuticle area and then I'll be going in with my shaping tool and that will uh, buff off that top layer on my nails so we can apply our nails and this is just going to take off that nice shiny layer and kind of buff up our nails. Just take your time and do light and even strokes across your nail. You don't want to go too heavy handed with this tool because it can damage your nail bed. Once we do that, I'm going to go in with my acetone nail polish remover and that's just going to clean off any oils on my nails and I am now picking out my sizes for my press-ons. I absolutely love doing my press-on nails at home. I just enjoy doing my nails at home but since it is Halloween I decided to do something nice and cute and spooky and I want to kind of add some designs and I came across these uh, purple gel palette by Dash and Diva and I just had to uh, use them so just using some regular nail glue that was already in the package I'm just applying my press-ons and I hold the nail on for 30 seconds and then we'll move on to the next one once all our nails are applied I will then buff my nails again using that shaping tool and precision shaper and that's going to shape my press-ons as well as buff off that top layer so we can apply our gel polish. is day four of our seven days of Halloween on our channel. And I have thoroughly enjoyed creating all of my looks and preparing for Halloween day. I just can't wait for Halloween. Even though we're not doing our traditional trick and treat, me and the girls will still be having fun events and dressing up as well. If you are new to our channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you can check out all of our other Halloween videos for our seven days of Halloween. We have a playlist listed seven days of Halloween so you can watch all our other videos and like this video if you love Halloween nails. Tell me what your costume is going to be for this year in the comments below. I was definitely looking forward to Halloween this year. I created three different looks on our channel for Halloween, I was a witch, the Mad Hatter, and the Shashire Cat from Alice in Wonderland, and I thoroughly enjoyed creating all of those looks. Don't forget to check out those videos and tutorials as well. I will leave the link in the description bar for you guys to click on and check out later. I did have a difficult time applying this gel polish to my nails. This was my first time actually using anything like this. Usually I just use regular 
press on nails but i decided to do something a little bit different plus i really like the designs of this palette but luckily these gel stick-ons are beginner friendly so if you do mess up you can easily peel it off and try to reapply it correctly i found that i kept getting creases in a lot of my nails when applying the polish so just make sure to pull the polish nice and taunt to the nail that way you don't get any creases or bubbles and press it out nice and smooth and it was good to go after a couple of tries after a few nails i finally got it down pat Any excess nail will simply be fouled off. Just foul it down off in a downward motion. Try not to do your original side to side because it can peel the gel polish off of the nail and we don't want to do that. Once I have completed all of my nails, I'm then going to go in with a clear coat to seal it all off. I really enjoyed the design. It was really cute. This was definitely something different from my usual press on nails and they were perfect for my witch creation that I did for Halloween. We'll let our nails dry and we are completely done. And here is a snippet of my witch costume that I created with my new fabulous nails.